in 1992, the incidence of uh, teenagers having plastic surgery were probably around 30 teenagers per day having plastic surgery now, believe it or not. It's almost 200 teenagers per day having a surgical cosmetic procedure. I think that the standards of beauty have, have really changed uh, from, let's say, the 50s until now. Miss America uh, in the 50s was 5 feet 7 uh, and uh, weighed 150 pounds, whereas last year it was 5 foot 9, weighed 117 pounds. All this tends to influence uh, the child who is growing up uh, and who all of a sudden is faced with the reality that appearance does matter in our society. I think that being a teenage girl is almost like being a walking Miss America contest almost every day. But as with adults, surgeons won't do any procedure without first meeting strict criteria. The main thing is that, first of all, that the patient themselves initiates the request. In other words, that the parent isn't the one that's wanting her, his or her child to have uh, cosmetic surgery. Obviously, if there isn't a problem, then there isn't anything to do. And the final thing is that they be psychologically stable and fit, that there isn't any problem with eating disorders, uh, there isn't any problem with bulimia, uh, with overly anxious, depressed individuals, uh, because obviously not only uh, would they have a difficult time with the cosmetic surgery, but it probably won't affect uh, what they want it to affect, and it may actually make it worse in their life. Their feelings that uh, everything depends upon their appearance is true in most cases. Unfortunately, our society definitely places too much emphasis on on appearance, uh, but it's neither for me to say or change.